what's up you guys it's marsh here and uh yeah we're back with another video it's been a while and uh this might be the most unclimatic introduction to such a sick car but uh yeah you guys this is my uh midnight purple r33 gtr and uh man yeah i've had this car for one whole year now and we finally got it done and uh it's looking fresh so the first like five or so months on this car um it had some like engine problems we needed to fix a bunch of exhaust leaks uh replace the headers gotta um change all the gaskets on the car and then after that we needed to get it tuned um took it down to uh bow at a bbr tuning and he worked his magic on this thing put down 550 to the wheels uh car hits boost it's crazy when it hits boost it's it's everything you in my head when i was a kid i thought a gtr would be and then after that the car we took it to paint have the entire car repainted so this is like two week old two week old paint the car is an original midnight purple car i just wanted it to look brand new right like i wanted this car to be mint the engine is completely um all the maintenance has been done to the engine now and now the car's been painted and one year later we finally have the car back we finally can do some mods today is not really an intro of the car I just have a new exhaust for this thing. So this car is full full exhaust, right? Like has gritty headers. Um, I added a test pipe to it and it's running a Kakimoto exhaust. But the exhaust on this car is just way, way too quiet. I'll throw in a couple of exhaust clips here. But as you guys can see, the car makes a shit ton of engine noise, a shit ton of turbo noise, but there just isn't much exhaust noise, especially for how good this RV can sound. So I've had this exhaust for a few months now, so I'm pretty excited to throw it on. Here it is, you guys. I think uh, if you guys know how I like my cars to sound, this is the expected exhaust. So we got the full titanium Tomei exhaust for this thing. And uh, from everything I've seen online, this this is what makes the RB scream. I want that kind of higher pitch, cleaner, uh, six cylinder sound that you can get out of the RB. And I just want it to be stupid loud. So yeah, we had to go with the Tomei full tie. Let's get the car jacked up. Um, first time for me jacking up this car. So we'll get it jacked up, take out that stock exhaust, throw this bad boy on there. Hopefully it goes pretty seamlessly, but I think this is, gonna take a little bit longer than a normal exhaust install for me maybe maybe a couple hours so let's get into it first mod um, that I'm personally doing everything else I had on this car I just wanted to sh I just wanted to have it done professionally so all the engine work and everything everything done at a shop this is the first thing that I'm I'm gonna be doing to the car myself guys as you guys can see it's nighttime now because I started this install way too late had to run to the store to get some more uh, WD-40 but uh yeah exhaust pretty atypical right we got the stock one out a um, couple bolts to the cat and then exhaust hangers as usual so got this out um, and let's go show you guys the new so we got that out the cat this is a I don't know, Kakimodu Regu R6. Um, sounds decent, but it's really quiet and doesn't really let that RB sing like you know the RB can sing like. Um, so let's go show you guys that new Tome. We got the Tomei titanium exhaust unwrapped and 
man this this is a nice ass exhaust and i got i just gotta say man it's like is there a better feeling than like unwrapping brand new car parts especially especially when it's nice car parts you know yeah i've seen like clips of this shit on youtube and i am excited to put this on that that thing is gonna sound like a monster with this exhaust so yeah just waiting for my friend to come over to kind of like help me hold it up because i don't want to damage this like trying to install it too much get too many scratches on it all right let's get this done it's, it's that one this little pipe this shit is so light i think we got brian here he's gonna help me so i don't completely scratch this thing up As you guys can see, got everything in there. Went in pretty smoothly, it took about like 20 minutes. Pretty, pretty easy install. Um, man, does that exhaust look good. The only thing we gotta do left now is these spring clamp boys. We got the spring clamps on. The only tough one actually was, was this guy on the top here because it was hard to get my pliers in there, but we got all four on pretty easily, so. Yeah, there it is. That's uh, finally the good part, you know? Get to set her down. Start it up. Pretty excited, to be honest, you guys. Things just sound pretty nasty. with the cams the cams before you couldn't really tell the car was cammed now you can really hear the cams this thing is sheesh damn boys boys yeah let's go for a let's go for a little drive
car, boys. What a car.
<laughs> yeah, that shit sounds saucy. Sorry, neighbors. It's gonna wrap up the video, guys. Fucking car sounds insane. <laughs>